What? Yeah, I, I never saw Toy Story two. Why? Did... I liked Toy Story, but I didn't like it that much. Oh my gosh! See, this is where it all goes down. Hey, how's it going? I'm DJ Flight, and with me is Mindy. Hi. She, of course, does our afternoon、uh, drive time show on Saturday. What you probably don't know about her is that she is a huge Disney fan. Yes, I am. So one of the big things that's going on right now is the Disney versus Pixar bracket. So we thought we'd ask our expert and put her through the paces. So what it is is it pits all the Disney movies against each other. Yep. To find who the best Disney movie is, and then it pits all the Pixar movies against each other to find the best Pixar movie,、mm -hmm. and then those two get pitted against each other to figure out who the best one is. Yes. And when you first told me about this,、mm -hmm. I was like, "How cruel! How could you do this to a huge Disney fan?" Like. All right. So we're gonna start off with round one, and we're gonna focus on the Disney. Okay. So the first one is Lion King versus Tarzan. Okay, that one is an easy one for me. I feel like Lion King wins. Yeah, I think Lion King is the winner in this one for me as well. It's Lion King at the end of the day. Yeah. The Princess and the Frog versus Lilo and Stitch. When Lilo and Stitch came out, that was my favorite movie. Like that's it. That's my、yeah. favorite movie. But Princess and the Frog is a really good movie as well, and the storyline. And but Lilo and Stitch, like Lilo and Stitch. Ohana means family, and family means no one gets left behind. So Lilo and Stitch. Well, I'm gonna go with Princess and the Frog on this one. So we've got Tangled versus Big Hero Six. Now I didn't mind. I like Big Hero Six. It's based on the Marvel property, so I'm I'm happy. But I like Tangled more. Yeah, I would say Tangled. Just、yeah. the story of Rapunzel、mm -hmm. as well. And、um, this is just round one. Round one's easy. <laughs>、um, okay, now Frozen versus Moana. Okay, that is a tough one. Like, why? I could lose sleep over this decision. Frozen is great.、Mm -hmm. You know, has、mm -hmm. a great soundtrack. Great soundtrack. Great characters.、Mm -hmm. And then you look at Moana, and it has the exact same thing. So it's really, got the rock. but then Frozen has Olaf, and he's so cool. He's literally cool because he's a snowman. This is okay. This is ha ha ha. So funny. That's so, a Disney joke. So I think it, for me, it comes down to、um, whether I like summer or winter be better, and I'm going to go with summer. Moana wins.、Uh, next one is Aladdin versus Hercules. Okay. If you choose anything other than Aladdin here, we can't be friends. Okay, so I'm picking Aladdin. Thank、then. you. Yeah, Little Mermaid versus Pocahontas. I actually own the Pocahontas VHS, kids. If you don't know what that is, Google it.、Hmm. But the Little Mermaid is just everyone. Everyone loves the Little Mermaid. I have watched that movie probably like a bazillion times. Really? Not because I wanted to. Oh, okay. It was because my little cousin loved the Little Mermaid, and I think we we ended up I think ruining like two tapes because we watched it so often. <laughs> Now it's Mulan versus Zootopia. To me, I, I'm gonna pick Zootopia on this one. Like its its underlying message is so big, and then for them to actually have created that into a, an animated movie, it's a really good way of addressing the issue. So I think it's a good movie. All right, I'm gonna choose Milan just by default because、mm -hmm. I haven't seen Zootopia, but、yeah. you've sold me on Zootopia. I'm gonna watch it. All right, so the last one on the Disney side for round one is Beauty and the Beast versus Nightmare Before Christmas. I love Nightmare Before Christmas,、yes. but paired against、um, Beauty and the Beast, it can't win. Beauty and the Beast has Beauty everything. Beauty and the Beast, yeah, it's yeah. probably the the winner on most people. Most, not everyone. Yeah. So that's round one. Now we're gonna go to round one for Pixar. So round one, first bracket is Up versus Brave. I liked Brave, but Up wins. Up wins all the time because the the story, the first twenty minutes of it, it was so sad. I'm I'm actually gonna go with Brave on this one because I like. What? I am gonna go with Brave on this one. Toy Story versus Toy Story Two. Yeah. I never saw Toy Story Two. What? Why? Were you busy for the last twenty <laughs> years? I, you know what? I liked Toy Story, but I didn't like it that much. Oh my gosh! See, this is where it all goes down. I have seen all the Toy Story movies, and I cannot wait for a Toy Story、uh, a, a billion because they're all so good. I'm gonna go with the original Toy Story. Toy Story Two was good as well, but Toy Story the original for me. It's Coco versus Cars Two. Yes, I didn't see Cars 2. Okay, 
But yeah, but I liked Coco, so I'm gonna go with Coco on this one. Yeah, I agree. I'm gonna go with Coco. Um, I watched this with my four-year-old niece, mm -hmm. and she loved it. It had such a nice storyline. I think mm -hmm. I cried in that movie too. Like it, it was really nice and good music as well. Yeah. Yep. I think Pixar hasn't done their job if they haven't made you cry at some point. All right. So now the next one is Toy Story 3 versus The Good Dinosaur. Hmm? I didn't see The Good Dinosaur. I didn't either. <laughs> So I think we're gonna go with Toy Story 3. Yeah. Not because we don't like the good dinosaur, it's just because we don't really know it. All right, so the next one is Ratatouille versus A Bug's Life. It's it's not a hard one for me. I'm going to choose Ratatouille. I think Ratatouille is underrated. For me, I think I'm gonna go with A Bug's Life on this one because it, it is, it's based on one of my favorite movies, which is The Seven Samurai, which is a Kira Kurosawa movie from like the 50s. All right, so the next one is Finding Nemo versus Inside Out. How do you choose between Finding Nemo, which is a classic now? That's a tough one. I did like Inside Out and I thought it was a really good movie, mm -hmm. but I think Finding Nemo was a bigger deal. I mean, yeah, I think I'm gonna go with Finding Nemo on this one. So the next one is Monsters, Inc. versus Cars. Okay, another it, tough one. Really? I don't think oh, so. Gosh. Because I, I watched Cars. Once I saw it, I was like, okay, I'm good. Yeah. Whereas Monsters, Inc., I could watch that again and again. Oh my gosh, this is a tough one for me to decide on. The tipping tractors. <laughs> <laughs> I think that is so cool. <laughs> Monsters, Inc. wins. I have a selfie with Sully. So this is now my hard one, which is the incredible... Incredibles versus Wally. Hmm. I love The Incredibles because it's a superhero movie. This is like the Fantastic Four done right. But Wally is a really good movie. <laughs> this movie is actually a movie that's made with very little dialogue, and yet you feel this story and this connection to these characters. Yeah. With just like their names being said. They really shouldn't have put The Incredibles and Wally together. They should have put like Incredibles versus like Toy Story 2 or something. That was a. Um, it's a tough one for me too, but I'm gonna say Incredibles. So now we're gonna go into round two. This is where it starts to get really hard. And it's Lion King versus Princess and the Frog for me. Okay, and I have Lion King versus Lilo, versus and, Lilo, Lilo and, and Stitch. Stitch. Right, Lion King. Lion King? Easy. I'm gonna go with Princess and the Frog on this one. What? Yeah. I, I mean, I like the Lion King, but on this side, it's not my favorite. I chose the wrong answer, but that's okay. <laughs> Moving along. So now the next one for me is Tangled versus Moana, and that's the same for you. Um, I'm gonna go with Moana. Yeah, I think so. I think there was more of a message for Moana. So now the next one is Aladdin versus Little Mermaid. Can't choose between Aladdin and the Little Mermaid. I'm gonna have to go with Aladdin. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, me too. So the next one is Zootopia versus Beauty and the Beast. You, it's Mulan versus Beauty and the Beast. Yeah, it's gotta be Beauty and the Beast. Yeah, mine is Zootopia. What? Yeah, I, I actually am not a big fan of Beauty and the Beast. I've seen the Beauty and the Beast original movie. I've seen the live action. I've gone to watch it in live theater. I love it. Oh. Yeah. So that's round two. Now we're gonna do round two versus one Pixar. For me, it's Brave versus Toy Story. And you are... Up versus Toy Story. Can't get over Toy Story. It has everything. Toy Story wins for me. Yeah, I'm going with Brave. That's not even a contest for me. What are you gonna do? So now we've got Coco versus Toy Story 3 for us. And I am going to go mm. with Toy Story 3. Mm. I feel like you can't really top it. Like Coco was great. Good movie but not better than Toy Story 3. It's Bugs Life versus Finding Nemo for me. Okay, and I have Ratatouille versus Finding Nemo. Nemo is such a is such a big deal, but I think this was just somehow bigger. Yeah, I agree, <coughs> Finding Nemo. All right, so Monsters, Inc. versus The Incredibles. I think I'm gonna go with The Incredibles on this. And I am going to go with Monsters, Inc. Yeah? Yeah. Mm. Now we're gonna do round three for Disney. This is essentially the final four. We're gonna get into the final four now. For me on on uh, the Disney side, we've got Princess and the Frog versus Moana. Yeah, I've got Lion King versus Moana. I think for me, it's Moana. Really? For me, it is the Lion King. Yeah. All right, and then it's Aladdin versus Zootopia for me. And Aladdin versus Beauty and the Beast. Like, these are really tough decisions. Yeah. So essentially, this is like asking us, like, which is your favorite child? Yeah. And neither of us have kids, 
but... Th this is our equivalent. Yeah. Yeah. I relate more to Aladdin. I think I'm gonna go with Aladdin as well. Now we're gonna do the final two for Pixar. So for me, it's Bray versus Coco. Okay, and for me, it is Toy Story versus Toy Story 3. Toy Story 3 was good, but Toy Story is the original. It is the first Pixar movie. I'm gonna go with Toy Story. I think I'm gonna go with Brave. Yeah. I think Brave is going all, not all the way, but it's, and now for me, it's Nemo versus The Incredibles. Okay, and I have Finding Nemo versus Monsters, Inc. I'm going with The Incredibles. Really? I thought we were going to be in sync and say Finding Nemo. No. Finding yeah. Nemo for me. All right, Incredibles for me. The best Disney movie, period, dot. <laughs> so for me, it's Moana versus Aladdin. And for me, it is Lion King versus Aladdin. Ugh. This is so difficult. Like, how do you choose? I have to go with Lion King. Lion King, really? Yes. Between Aladdin and The Lion King, if I had to choose one movie that I was going to watch over and over again, like if that was some kind of torture, yeah. <laughs> I'd watch Lion King. For me, I've got Moana versus Aladdin, and I like, I like Moana, uh, but I think I'm gonna go with Aladdin on this one. My final is Aladdin, and yours is Lion King. Lion King. Woohoo! All right. And so now we've got Brave versus The Incredibles for me. And I've got Toy Story versus Finding Nemo. I'm gonna go with Toy Story. Yeah? Yeah, the wow. original Pixar movie. For me, although I love Brave, and like I said, it, it speaks to so many people in my life, mm -hmm. I'm gonna go with Incredibles. Incredibles. Yeah. Wow, Incredibles yeah. went all the way for you. And again, it could easily be taken out by Wally. -E. Like, like moods change like every <laughs> second for me. I'm still sitting there. Like, really, Incredibles could it be Wally? -E? But yeah. Mm -hmm. So Aladdin versus Incredibles and Lion King versus Toy Story. This is this is it. This is the big one. This is the big final. Okay. Secretly, no, looking at this. I kind of knew that it would get down to those two mm. for me, but now having to make that decision, I don't know, I keep going back and forth. This is incredibly difficult, but I am going to have to choose. <laughs> I'm stalling. <laughs> um, okay, I'm gonna have to choose and I'm going to go with Toy Story. The reason is because being the first 3D animated movie. Yeah, from Pixar. Being the first, and that mm -hmm. was back in, what, 1995, I wanna say? It still holds up. Mm. Toy Story being a movie from such a long time ago, it's still great. Like, mm -hmm. kids can watch it today, adults can watch it today for the very first time and fall in love with the movie. Yeah, I, I'm gonna go with Toy Story. Toy Story? Yeah, for me, it's Aladdin versus Incredibles. Yeah, so. <sighs> How do you choose? They're not Indians, but they kind of, kind of, almost are, kind of, kind of not really, but kind of are Indians. <laughs> this is like, at this point in time, the closest thing we have to like an Indian Disney film to a certain degree. So that's really cool. And you get to, again, yeah, Robin Williams. I mean, come on, yeah. Robin Williams, but incredible. It's superheroes or Wally, -E. <laughs> but it's, it's superheroes. I think. You've chosen, you have to go I with know, Incredible. No, I think I'm gonna go with Incredibles. What? Yeah. Incredibles over Aladdin. Yeah. So for us, it's a Pixar. Yeah. Pixar wins. Pixar wins at the end of the day for us. I think it was harder for you to pick the Pixar ones. Yeah. Yeah. And for me, I, I feel like the Disney side was a lot harder. Yeah. Well, there you go. That's ours. Although I don't think you can read mine, but anyway. <laughs> Thank you for watching, and uh, we'll see you in another video.